left Vegas on Sunday night. Post-race inspection was completed. We were confident that we had made the right call on the 12. After we, we got back home, um, as Brad alluded to, you know, it was a significant infraction. It was a significant penalty. It had a lot of ramifications uh, around the playoffs. So as we would always do, we we would review um, any infraction from the weekend, and we started that process yesterday morning. More information was available uh, to us at that time on basically when we unloaded uh, the vehicles on uh, Friday morning and started the inspection process and just really diving into the uh, the damper inspection process. Uh, it wasn't consistent from the time we opened on Friday until we uh, finished our post-race inspection on on Sunday night. That's on us. Um, it's a, something that we will take a much deeper dive into in our process and procedures and, and how we eliminate that from happening again and going forward. But ultimately, we got to the right spot and uh, we made the right decision. Still feel like we made the right decision on Sunday night, but also the right decision yesterday to rescind the DQ, uh, give the 12 um, their well-earned, well-deserved uh, six place finished or points um, as we head off into Homestead this week. So unfortunate that we had to deal with that. But at the end of the day, um, we felt like we got it right. Believe the garage will feel the same way. You know, the question came up, you know, from Dave last night. Um, did the other inspection vehicles go through the same process that the 12 did? And absolutely they did. Um, the difference was when you're in the playoffs, every team is going to be pushing the envelope. And the closer you get to the edge of stepping out of bounds, the closer you're to stepping out of bounds. And our process needs to be consistent throughout the weekend. And it wasn't. Um, as Brad, again, uh, spoke to last night, we will, that, that's on us. That's our responsibility to make sure that does not ever happen again. Uh, we will review our processes today and procedures and make sure that that is buttoned up as we get into Homestead this weekend.